Oh, dude. Time for another beer review. It's Friday challenge time. I've said beer review. It's not a beer. Um, it, as it's Friday challenge, I'm going into the archives of something that... Well, any flavour that I can get, I'm doing on Friday challenge. And I've been in Dumfries today and I have picked up Dragon Soup, Apple and Blackcurrant flavour. 7.5%, 500 mil. I haven't had this one before. It looks fantastic. So, for those who are new to the channel, on a Friday, I do whatever you want me to drink alcohol-wise on a Friday. And Dragon Soup is one of them things which is open, whereby there's that many flavours. If I come across them, I'm going to review them on Friday Challenge. And Apple and Blackcurrant, I have never seen before. Lovely art design. Um, so... It's kind of an alcopop versus an energy drink. That's the easiest way to describe what I'm expecting. So I'm going to get that. I'm expecting to get an apple and blackcurrant flavour and that Red Bull taurine kind of thing going. So this is hissing at me like mad as I'm pouring this. Um, deep purple. Um the, the thing that's jumping out at me, um, the first thing I'm thinking is, is it's an even deeper purple than Strongbow Dark Fruit. That is as deep as it gets as I was pouring it. There's a lot of bubbles going up to it. The hiss was coming as I was pouring it. Um, get the nose. And it nails exactly what they've said, apple and blackcurrant. Um, I would have said the apple was jumping out more than the blackcurrant. It's got that Ribena vibe about it. Yeah. The energy drink, Red Bull aroma isn't coming out. But it does feel like it's apple and blackcurrant on steroids. And it feels like there's, there's like an underlying character that's going to give me a slap. So, um, right. Yeah, um, this sounds weird. It sounds, it smells like um, apple and blackcurrant plus, like, like Beecham's. Yeah, so it's got that, like, underlying, like, um, paracetamol vibe about it, but it's also got, um, yeah, it's good for you. <laughs> no. Um, yeah, it's got the it's got the the flavors, the aromas that you would expect, but it's got a little like paracetamol medicinal vibe about it, more than uh, yeah, like a locket, um, blackcurrant lockets, yeah, yeah, it's it, it smells like that, yeah, right, we're diving in, cheers. And um, it's not fizzy. Um, some a lot of these kind of drinks are fizzy, and there's no fizziness, there's no carbonation about it. Um, the black currant was screaming at me as it entered the mouth, and then I started to get the apple flavour behind that. That taurine energy drink flavour isn't there at all. It just it feels like. Boozy black currants. This is the one out of, and I've done a lot of dragon soups on the channel. You can go through my Friday Challenge place, and I think I've got a dragon soup place. You can go through that, and pretty much on all of them, I'll turn around and say, Oh, it doesn't taste its strength. This one's got a real boozy kick about it. That said, I've had a few beers today. Um, I'm I'm half cut on this review, um, more than I normally am. Um, but yeah, it's it feels it feels boozy. It feels like it's gonna it's giving me a wallop. So it doesn't have the regular characteristics of a dragon soup for me. This one. Um, Imagine if you bought a bottle of shots, 
um, some kind of blackcurrant flavoured shots and you were pouring them all out in your little glasses and you went one, two, three, boom. It's got that kind of flavour about it, um, just not as syrupy. Um, yeah, it's flat, which is flat and the energy drink flavour isn't coming out. So, um, I'll, you know me, if you've watched these videos, I like these kind of drinks. This is the one I'm probably the most underwhelmed with out of all the dragon soups so far. Um, and that's not because I've, I've had some fancy pants beers today. I just... The mouthfeel, um, the fact that I like to drink them and feel like I get a little five pence buzz and not think I'm drinking alcohol. And I'm not getting that on this one. So, yeah, this one... Um, I think for the first time I'm going to say it's off. It's like poor for, for what I expect. It's not awful. It tastes okay. But it's just it's just not doing it for me, this one. So I'm disappointed um, for the first time from drinking a dragon soup, I think. So that's apple and blackcurrant dragon soup. Um, I'll add it to the relevant playlist. So thanks for watching it. On to the next one. Cheers.